Hello everyone, it's me, Final Ninja Dog, and I'm here on Skyland Spire's Adventure. Now you're probably wondering why I'm here because I've complete I've completed the walkthrough series, and as you can see, the crop light is fixed. But I'm going to show you something that you can do on the game after or during any time throughout the game. So once you've completed the game, you can carry on upgrading your Skylanders, getting them some more money for upgrades, going on battle mode, or doing a heroic challenge. Now I'm going to do Trigger Happy's heroic challenge. It's one of the hardest I've actually done. Right, so at the moment I've got eight heroic challenges. It's for... Oh yeah, I need to sort that out. I seem to be missing some. Anyway, so it's for um, one player only, sadly. And I'm going to go and trigger Happy's Heroic Challenge because that's the hardest one I've experienced. Oops, sorry. Basically, what you need to do is you're in the battlefield here. Um, it might be the Green Goo Factory, I don't know. It's one of the ones where you're fighting trolls. So now we need to get to the troll, the artifact that the trolls have stolen. There are different, like, zones. Oh dear, I teleported. There are different zones, and once, um, once all of the enemies in the zones have appeared or disappeared, then a teleporter appears. Now you need to get it in the right order because there's a time limit. And as you can see, I went through the wrong one because I accidentally landed there. So I've got to choose the right path. If I don't choose the right one, then I go to um, another part of the game, or the map, and once I defeat those guys, only one teleporter appears. <clears throat> right, so I'm going to try and get all of the guys' heroic challenges in, um, or all of the heroic challenges wrong way again. I'm going to try and make one video with all of the Ferrite challenges, but I can't really promise anything. I might have to do it in two parts, or edit it. I'm not doing very good. Trigger Happy is quite powerful. Right, um, I don't actually know the code off by heart, I did when I was, I knew most of it when I was trying to um, complete the game, or when I was trying to complete their heroic challenges, because <clears throat> you can basically do uh, the heroic challenges again and again, uh, and for each of the Skylanders. Oh, halfway. So I can play this heroic challenge with any of my Skylanders. I'm not actually going to because it's going to be too much time. So I'm going to make uh, certain Skylanders do certain heroic challenges. It's like if it's theirs, then I'm going to do it. And this is the first one, probably because it's the hardest one I've seen. At the moment, um, I've done all of their... I've made them do... Every, Everyone's for our challenges, but no one has actually done um, Wrecking Ball's heroic challenge or Hex's heroic challenge, so that's going to be new to me as well. If you want, you can try and mix it up and do random ways, or you can try and choose like a set direction. Say like you want to go right all the time, then I suppose you could try that. Might waste a lot of time though. <clears throat> oh, I didn't even know that teleporter was there. Right, I think I... There, and this is the last part. Now, the artifact that you're trying to get is in this tank, so once you blow it up you can get it. 
There's the artifact. And that is Trigger Happy's heroic challenge done in five minutes. Or round about. Then afterwards, Kali says some stuff. Great, a thumbs up from Kali. Very nice. So, now I'm going to choose another Skylander. I think I'll go with this guy. Gil Grant. I should actually start using their um, proper names, the names that I've given them. Yeah, back for more training, yeah, yeah. Now, Gil Grant's heroic challenge is over here. This is, um... I think this is the one where you have to collect all of the statues. Basically, you've got to save those, um... Those Mabu people from, uh... These trolls. And in certain places, you... Oh, they're Cyclopses, sorry. Certain places, you, uh, can blur... Destroy certain things and you get keys. Like that one up there. So once I can move this, I can use the bounce pad to get So you've got to save six of these guys. At the moment I've done two. Now there are, there's more than six Mabu people. So uh, I think one of them is like across water. So if you're using a Skylander that can't get across water, then you can do another one, which is good. I'm going to try and take a shortcut here. Oh. <clears throat> when I meant shortcut, I was going to go across the water. But, nah, it's fine. Mmm, the key. I don't know why, but there is one place, I think it's here. Oh, no, it's not. There is a place that where there are loads... There it is. I'm not sure why you can't get in there. You might have to defeat some enemies or something first. But I'm not going to do it. No key up here. Let's go over here then. Right. Um, I think there's about six... No. There's about eight Mabu people that you need to rest all that. There are available to rescue, but like I said, you don't have to rescue all of them. You can rescue certain ones. So this is... Are there eight? I, I thought there were seven. Anyway, so this is my fifth Mabu person rescued. More spikes. So either certain Skylanders, or you have to defeat all the enemies. So there's more than seven, I think. There might be eight, nine, or ten. So, what you need to do here, you just push all these turtles, there's a Mabu person over there, but, you might be able to see, I'm kind of like going backwards here, because there's a bridge here that allowed me to get across, but I'm not going to save that Mabu person, I'm going to show you this place over here, which is where there's a key, but, no Mabu person, that's because you've got to take this teleporter. And that's six Mabu people saved. And that was under five minutes, which is good. So now that gives me plenty of time to do someone else's heroic challenge. So each of the heroic challenges are different speeds. Yeah, yeah. Such a privilege. You get Kali's personal thumbs up. Right, let's go with another Skylander now. So that's two down, eight to go. Once I get my Fire Skylander, I might kind of edit his hero challenge in, or her, I think they're all boys. But I'll edit his hero challenge in, well, either edit it at the end of this, or um, make another video. Anyway, Sparrow's hero challenge, where are thou paintings? Basically, there are six paintings, some are friends, some are foes. Oh, sorry, I didn't do that. I didn't uh, show you. But anyway, so there are six paintings, and you need to destroy them in order to feed the spirits. So that was that Boomer who I just saved. I'm going to go up here, see what's... Open this gate. And there are zombies, so 
only a fire and cannons can defeat them, remember? Oh, that ground pound didn't work. <clears throat> I think this map kind of goes around in a circle. Because there's a gate over here. Which you can also unlock. Which I think it, it leads you to the same sort of place. Up there there's the second painting that I destroyed. That was good. I'm just going to run past all of these as fast as I can go. And there's one of those dry witches. Yeah, you've got to save her, I know it's bad. So, we've only got two left. One more painting left, and I know exactly where it is. I think, no, I don't know. I think that this map is actually used for Sonic Boom's Rock Challenge as well. I'll show you hers later. And here is the last painting, destroyed. That's the rope challenge complete in about three or four minutes. Now, who can I do next? Wow! Didn't think you had it in yet. I know. Took this challenge on and really tore it up. Enjoy the extra power. Yeah, I think Callie only has like three or f three sayings. So let's get this order of people ready. That's the order. Um, already done then. So I'm just talking to myself and sorting out the order of Skylanders. I'm going to do the heroic challenge sim. So this is Prison Break. And his heroic challenge is taking out a lot of spiders. There we go. Lair of giant spiders. Now because this is a mine, it's good because there, although there's those rocks, and the uh, zone crystals, we can uh, take them out easily because we're using an Earth Skylander. So let's push some blocks about. And here, no, uh, I thought it was. Blur the Zoe crystals, and we'll get that pickaxe. See, there's a pickaxe there, just in case if you're using a different Skylander. So, if you're using a non-Earth Skylander, you'll be able to uh, use the pickaxe to destroy the bricks. Right, the uh, two out of six. No, nunchuck failure. If anyone knows how to fix your nunchuck when it fails like that, please tell me because it does that a lot. It's very annoying. Oh, I didn't realise that was a shortcut. Huh? Most of the time I kept on wasting my time pushing those blocks about. I didn't actually need to. Oh my god. Some of these, um, the maps of the Horror Challenges are used twice. This is also Stump Smash's Horror Challenge, or the map for it. So, let's go find our sixth spider. Which is here. Done. And that was about three three minutes, I guess. Hopefully, I should be able to do the rest of their all the others. You did it. I think when I'm not sure if you get challenge. more. Um, if you do the Hurrah challenge um, again from the same profile, I'm not sure if um, you get more experience from that, or if you have to go onto another profile and do that Hurrah challenge from that profile. Yeah. Mm -hmm.
but maybe later I'll um I'll get some more speed for my slow guys. But the only problem is um I haven't found I think I've only got one Skylander with um who's heroic challenge increases speed and that's trigger happy. Does Hex no Hex isn't speed. Right, let's do Sonic Boom's heroic challenge. This is the same map as Barrows, I said. Basically, there are a lot of um, enemies here. Um, what we need to do is we need to find a key. But each of these enemies give you more time once you defeat them. Huh, I'd beat you, Kali. <laughs> and there's the gate. Let's go. So as you can see, there's loads and loads and loads of these um, enemies which can be easily taken out especially if you're level 10 and fully upgraded so once you defeat the enemies you get more time in which you can break barrels to find keys you can only there's only one key though but you need to find the key to get out of this place Come on. I don't know why, but I usually find the key at the end of the game, like near the end of this level. I'm just going to keep on spawning uh, babies because sometimes they're slow. Because um, Sonic Boom is much faster than her babies, they're going to take more time to follow on. So I might have to keep on spawning more babies. So I've got all of them with me. There's the key and we're right next to the gate. To the gate! Yes, I know where the key was and I'm at the gate now. Let me put it in and stop wasting my time. And that is Sonic Boom's Rope Challenge done in about three minutes. So we have um, five down, three to go. You did it! I think when yeah, you yeah. down in this challenge, okay. you really come in there I accidentally took Sonic Boom yeah. off of the portal of power. That's bad. Often. I know, you're not very nice. Right. So now we're going to shove on our last Skylander. Or my last Skylander. You can't have him, he's mine. And it's Stump Smash. The Trojan Tree. I'm going to keep their hats on for now. <clears throat> I can't really be bothered to put, take them off. Yes, I want more training. So this is... Um, <clears throat> it depends how you do this game. Or this level. Or this right time, sorry. It can be kind of hard. Because there's a certain way that you need to go. There's lots of chompies. Or I think there might be crunches as well. And you've got to find, it's a bit like Sonic Boom's right challenge, and you need to find a key to open a gate. But you need to take out a hundred of those chompies. Yeah, that means that there's got to be a lot in this place. So I guess it's a bit like Prison Break's Heroic Challenge as well as um, Sonic Boom's Heroic Challenge in the fact that um, you need to find a key but you also need to defeat a certain amount of enemies. And also it's the same place as um, Prison Break's Heroic Challenge was in. Were there actually any chompies with armour on in the actual game? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I guess they might be um, chomp munchers, I think they're called. Anyway, so here is where you have to pick a path. There's only one key. So I'm going to go this way. Yes, there's a gate there and there's lots of chompies to destroy. There's the key. I was going to go back to those barrels to see if the keys were there, but no. I think um, you can get another key to open that gate there. 
pointless barrel. It's quite strange because sometimes when I do this uh, level, um, I'm, I've basically got one second left. And I, um, I complete it with one second left to spare. So apparently I chose the wrong path, I've got another key so I can choose the right path this time. I usually go that way first. <clears throat> I think um, Stump Smash seems to like attacking all these trompies or munchers. I guess uh, it kind of suits his name, Stump Smash, and he's uh, smashing stuff. So anyway, let's go up here, we've got ten chompies left. And I think, and they're all here. There's more than a hundred chompies here, so it's a good thing too. And that heroic challenge is complete with, uh, say, four or five minutes. So as you can see, these heroic challenges are quite quick, which is very good. Now I've got to do two heroic challenges that I have not done before. Look, when once I go? wait. Once we put up power. with Kali. Now not only will you get some extra power, who first? Um personal thumbs up. Oh. I'll go with you. No, um, actually. Actually I'll go with you. Right, I'm changing to my undead Skylander Hex. Skull girl. Yeah, still need a good name. I'm very sorry that I haven't actually changed the names of That's some of these Skylanders. Hex is actually taller than Kali. Anyway, so because I um, I film my heroic challenges quicker than I upload them, because I upload them weekly. This is the same map as Sonic Boom and Spyro. So we've got to find this golden, this golden thing, but we need to hit buttons in a certain order. Oh dear. I guess it's like pressure plate buttons. There's a lot of spikes here. There's a button. Let's hit it, see what happens. Oh no, there's three paths to go. going to take the middle one. Any extra time? No, get off me. Can you please stop attacking me? Did I cast that? Oh, there's a teleport. I'll take the teleporter. I really don't know which way I'm supposed to be going here. I think I've hit the first one. Nope, dead end. I think I hit the first button. That's probably the first one you need to hit. I don't actually know how many buttons there are here though. Hey, is this some sort of dead end? Oh no, there's a fence there. Button! Good, that's a button. So we need to get to that button over there. So there are three buttons you need to get, apparently in the right order. If you hit those three buttons, you can lower gates and um, get to that and try and get to that fork thing. Ah, here it is. Lower the gate, please. Yes, we have one button left to find, and it's on the other side. Oh, I get it. So each of these paths leads to a certain gate, which means, yeah, I was here before, I was over there. So each of the paths leads to a button, and I didn't even know because I went the other way. So that's all three of the gates lowered. Now I need to get the fork. Go away. I have plenty of time. Unless something goes wrong and I kind of, unless something happens and, and it, make the time go quick. So now, the bit where you choose the path, all of the teleporters have gone, 
Don't even know that. And let's get the golden fork. I wasn't swearing. I'm just um, getting the golden fork. So you get three armor for that. Bam. You took this challenge on and really tore it up. Enjoy the extra power. Which means that now I've done hexes for a challenge. I have, at the minute, one more heroic challenge left to do. That was about, I don't know, was that four minutes? I don't know, four or five minutes, I'd say. So we've got Wrecking Ball's heroic challenge left, or Mr. Fluffles, because I haven't been able to um, get a Fire Skyland yet, and as you can see, he's almost level 10. Hopefully he should become level 10 in this heroic challenge. Is uh, Wrecking Ball here? Hey, where is it? There it is. Jump around. So basically we need to get 90 charms um, on bounce pads. So if I can get 90 of them, then I can get... Oh, Wrecking Ball's good for speed. That means he can help speed up some of these guys. Okay, so we need to get charms by bouncing. I guess these bounce pads are good because they, you can kind of see the, um, you're higher than you are before. Are you telling me that this is the same map for the right challenge that, um, who is it? I don't know, is this the same map? Oh, there's, there's a secret storage of uh, charms there. So if we can find the key, then we should be able to get there. No. I guess Paul Wrecking Ball is afraid of heights because it sounds like he's in terrible pain. Either that or he's having the time of his life. Let's just say that he's having a good time, okay? Where's this teleport lead? Already did this bit. Do they work more? Are they work more? Mm, I think they're worth two. This is the same heroic challenge as Stump Smash and Prison Break. I guess because there's 32 Skylanders, you need 32 heroic challenges. It can be hard because there aren't. There's only like 21 maps or levels, I think. So I've got two minutes to get about 40, less than 40 charms. Oh, I can see the whole of the map here, or most of it. Unfortunately, I can't find the key, but I think I can see it from here. No, that's a charm. Where is that key? Yeah, this place was the beginning of Stump Smash's heroic challenge. No charm gets left behind. Now, teleport! That was bad. I don't know why I did that, I didn't mean to. I've got about 20 left. No, 10 left, sorry. Bad maths. Where's this lead? Yes, I'm at a good place and I found the key. Let's try and jump over to get the key. Now I've got to find that place where all the charms were. Can I jump over there? No! Sorry Wrecking Ball, I didn't mean to try and drown you. Right, I believe that the gate is over here somewhere. I'm just going to keep heading this way. I've got to find two charms left. Ah, there's the gate, which means I should have enough. If only I can get over here in a matter of about 20 seconds. Now it's 20 seconds. No! Yay, we did it. Now, time for Eruptor's Heroic Challenge. Now that uh, he is 
almost level 10, but fully upgraded, uh, he's ready for show and tell. So we're going to do his heroic challenge. <clears throat> right, now his heroic challenge is based on, well, it's a bit like Prison Breaks, Sonic Booms, um, uh, who else? And Stump Smash. It's a bit like Prison Break, Sonic Boom and Stump Smash is heroic challenges. But basically you've got to uh, take out certain enemies or a certain number of enemies. But basically, I need to... Uh, this place, which um, is Gilbrand's heroic challenge as well. Uh, the arena for that. Um, this place is filled with like enemies from different levels, and there's also the atomations or atomicons or whatever they're called. Basically, I need to defeat. I need to take out 75 enemies, and I get extra points for the uh, massive robots, the atomicons or. Automations, I don't know how they're spelled or how they're pronounced. But I'm over halfway there now. Where is it? There it is. Almost there. This was the start of Gilgrom's Rack Challenge. Right, now I need to go... Oh dear. What's that wasp doing there? Go away, wasp. Silly hornet thing. One more. And that is... Eruptor's Rack Challenge done. In only two minutes, or three. Automations, that's what they are. Well, she said that quite a lot to some of my other Skylanders. So that is all of my Skylanders Hero Challenges done. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more videos coming soon. Thank you and goodbye.